Today we're going on Antelope Canyon boat tour. So uh, we'll be taking a tour around this beautiful area here. You can see it behind me. It's just beautiful, but it's really sad the water level is so low. Antelope Point Marina, all these floating docks everywhere. It's just crazy, all of this. And it all just floats here so that as the water level changes, you can go up or go down. It's just amazing. Even the buildings look like they're on floating docks as well. Just amazing. And we are underway for the Antelope Canyon boat tour. Just amazing looking back towards the marina out here. Exiting the main channel, going into Antelope Canyon. We had that white line was the high water mark last time they were there. They were two feet below it in 1999. So here we go, entering Antelope Canyon. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Everything here was created about 190 million years ago, so that's around the Jurassic period. So we do have quite a few dinosaur tracks up here. But 190 million years ago, this was the largest desert in the world. Canyon's pretty narrow in this particular area because the water is so low. You see all the mussels on the side here. They weren't here prior to 2012. In 2012, somebody from the Great Lakes brought his boat down here. And when he did, he didn't go through the proper procedures and ended up infesting it. So this whole lake is infested now with these, these mussels. Imagine the water being that much higher. It's just crazy how much this water level has dropped. This is just gorgeous here. Wow, oh, look at the canyon here. This is just, it really is beautiful here. Just such a shame about the water level being so low. Here's the view out the back. That hum you hear is the sound of the engine just purring along. I can say the water in this section is only about 30 feet deep has a very green tint to it here. Not quite sure why that is. Usually there's more kayakers in here. In the summertime they say they get 
300 or more kayakers in here. So they'll get off of their kayak and they'll hike in about a couple, a couple miles and they'll see a small version of a slot canyon. So you got Antelope Canyon from the water. This connects to Lower Antelope and then Upper Antelope. It's all Antelope Canyon. It's just different sections of the canyon. Yeah. Anybody get a one-way ticket? <laughs> You're literally at the end where the boat can go. I guess Andy does need to for the can. Yeah. So we're at the end where the boat can go for the canyon. Absolutely gorgeous. There are some kayakers back in there. You can see it's very shallow right there. We are now on our way out of Antelope Canyon. Just beautiful through here. Sorry about the wind noise, folks. Coming back in to the marina area, you can see over on the side all the different tires and the different weights and everything that they have set up to anchor these things. There are some really big houseboats here. You can rent these houseboats. Yeah, a lot of these you can rent. Look at the slide coming down this one here. Wouldn't that I be fun? That. <laughs> that would be so much fun. Yeah. Interested in renting a houseboat? They say the largest of these houseboats has six bedrooms. So well, that's pretty cool. And if you don't want to rent something that big, you can just do a little pontoon boat as well. But I think it would be cool to have a bunch of friends get together to rent one of these big houseboats. That would be the way to do it, that's for sure. They have smaller ones that don't have only two bedrooms too, right? Yes. Well, we hope you enjoyed that quick video of our uh, boat ride to Antelope Canyon. It was a lot of fun. We yes. really enjoyed ourselves. On Lake Powell there. Mm -hmm. Sorry about the wind noise on yeah, some of the segments. crazy. <laughs> some of the segments there, but it's uh, very pretty. And if I were to get rid of all the, the segments that had the, the wind noise in it, then it's... Uh, you kind of miss out on just how beautiful it is there. Yeah, and you kind of get the gist of just the beauty that's surrounding the area there. Even though the water's low, it didn't matter. It still was a beautiful ride through the uh, canyon there, and we had a really good time, really good boat captain that was very informative telling us everything. So if you get a chance to go there, be sure to take the little boat ride out there. I think you'd really enjoy it. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. So, so. We really appreciate you following us, and hope you'll hit like and subscribe and keep following all our adventure we have many more things ahead of us and we really appreciate you more than you know we hope you're well and having a great summer and we'll, we'll see, see you around the campfire, campfire. bye, bye.